The air is thick here. The sun gives off no warmth. Ferryman. A busy ferryman. Someone just had to kill the guardian of the gate, and now I'm up to my eyeballs in rotting new covers. So, unless some god sent you to plug all the holes and clean up the mess between the realms, I don't want anything to do with you. It just so happens that Hades sent me. What did a shiny, living fleshling like you do to end up in debt to the god of the underworld? I, uh may have killed Cerberus. Well, now that Hades' big dog is dead, rifts have opened all across the underworld. My passengers are being attacked by prisoners of Tartarus and all of his little dogs. Listen, I have to find four guardians to protect the gates and close the rifts. Hades said you'd need my help. Unbelievable. He sends a flesh thing through the underworld to fix a problem only the dead can solve. Only the dead can solve. So that's why I felt so weak when I fought those things. The last fleshling who worked for Hades wore a special suit of armor, but he's been torn to shreds. Now the armor's been scattered across the realm. My mother told me my path would be tough, but she never prepared me for this. And you're going to have to fight some pretty vengeful warriors to collect four of the pieces. The fifth, a set of gauntlets, has gone missing. You... do fine. What makes this armor I need so special? Forged on the bronze anvil that fell into Tartarus, it allows fleshlings like yourself to see things they shouldn't see, and go places they shouldn't go. Of course, Hades never mentioned this. He's very selective. You said something about prisoners. The Underworld's most horrific offenders are locked away in the prison of Tartarus. Many have escaped through the rifts and are putting the rest of us, hard-working, dedicated, passionate souls, in peril. What did you mean exactly when you said little dogs? The Hounds of Hades. Nasty little creatures who hunt and destroy the lost souls who want granted passage across the Styx by yours truly. Time to put this place back in order. All you need to do is collect some armor, defeat angry warriors, and find four guardians to protect the underworld. Right. Seeing as you're new here, I'll give you some advice. The Baron Pond, the Eternal Battlefield, and Hades Palace are all excellent places to start. And if you happen to have any spare time, I've got some work for you as well. Small to be an adult. What could those bones belong to? Dolls in the underworld. What's this? A message?
depuis. I never thought I'd see you again. Are you a god? Phoebe, it's me, Alexios. It's nice to meet you, Alexios. Is that your eagle? I wish I had an eagle. I know you do, Phoebe. I know you do. What are you doing here? Playing? How do you know my name? I could never forget your name. There hasn't been a day I don't think about you. I don't remember you. Do you work for the man with one eye? Who's that? He gave me this water when I was thirsty. You drank Lethe's water? <sighs> Phoebe, this is very important. I need you to remember who gave you that. I... I don't remember his name. Um, he took my toy. You had an eagle, like Icarus. If we get your eagle back, maybe you'll remember. No, I remember everything. I think... Try to think. Do you know where the man with one eye took your wooden eagle? I think he said something about a pit. The pit of deprivation? That's it. Do you remember anything from before drinking that water? No. I, I've always been here. The man with one eye should never have given you this water, or taken your toy eagle. We're going to get it back. You mean... steal? Stealing is exactly what I mean. Something tells me you're going to be a natural. Want to come with me? You want me to come on an adventure with you? Okay. Then let the adventure begin. You remind me a lot of a girl I knew on Kefalonia. Have you ever been there? Here. What was the girl like? Oh, she was <laughs> brave and smart. She'd say she looked up to me, but I'm the one who looked up to her. You looked up to her? Did you ever tell her? No. I wanted to. Don't be sad. I bet she knew. That girl left Kefalonia eventually. Where did she go? Athens, where she was loved by people like Pericles. Does that name sound familiar to you? <laughs> well, uh, off we go now. Tanthusa. No one who meets her forgets her. No, sorry. Okay, we're here. You'd better stay put while I go find your toy. I should be extra careful in this area.
is a guard. He lived on Kevalonia. <laughs> If this doesn't bring her memory back, we'll make new ones together. Eagle. Couldn't have done it without you. No. Hold it. Do you remember anything? Alexios? Yes. That's my name. Good, Phoebe. Good. You didn't come. 
I'm here now. I'm here. Everyone just left me. My parents, Marcos, Aspasia, even you. What was wrong with me? Wasn't I good enough? Of course you're good enough. Aspasia should have never let you go on your own. What happened is her fault, not yours. What do you mean? Why don't you tell me what you remember? Pericles was dying. Everyone who wasn't sick yet needed to get out of Athens. I thought I was alone. I was always alone. And then... <sighs> I'm so sorry, Phoebe. I'm... Where are the Golden Fields? You mean Elysium? I was there. It was beautiful. But I came here to find my parents. You traveled to the underworld to save your family? That's very brave. Just like you want to find yours. But mine still need me. I should go to them. Phoebe, you've been through a lot. And you've never met your parents. It's okay to be nervous. I was nervous to meet mine. I wouldn't be nervous... ...if you came with me. Before we go anywhere... ...where are your parents? I was following a clue. It said... ...those parted from their beloved... ...are doomed to the Ixion Wheel. Maybe I'm their beloved. Are you sure you're okay? No. But Amistios taught me to always be brave. Even when I'm feeling down. So I am being brave. Sailing to Elysium can be a difficult journey. Do you know how long you were there? I woke up on a boat. Everything was cloudy. Then there was light, and golden fields, and waterfalls. Only the bravest warriors are allowed there, you know? Descending to the Underworld is proof that you deserve your place among them. Oh, I don't know. It would be an honor to be there for you when you meet your parents. <laughs> Let's go! Last I heard about my parents, they were hiding near the Ixion Wheel. Hiding? From what? The underworld is scary. Maybe they're not fighters like us. I could teach them what you taught me. <laughs> I'm sure you could. <laughs> Baby, stay back! <laughs> Easy. I already told you. 
Go tell the Cyclops the girl isn't here. And neither is her family. Now get back! Relax. We're not going to hurt you. But we need to know what happened here. Those thugs followed the Cyclops of Kefalonia to their graves. And now they follow him in the underworld. He sent them through here, looking for a girl. The man with one eye. Have you ever met a girl named Phoebe? This is Phoebe. So you are. My dear, I loved your parents as I loved my own. They hid here with me and told tales about the great warrior Phoebe who sailed to Elysium. They called me a warrior? When Cerveros died, they snuck off to find you themselves. But the Cyclops is looking for you too. Excuse us, please. I remember now. The man with the one eye is the Cyclops. He forced me to drink the water. He must know we stole your eagle back and came to retaliate. What do we do? The gates to Elysium are open, but you know the Cyclops. He won't stop until he gets what he wants. We have to deal with him. What about her? She's a friend of my parents. I want to help her. She seems like she can fend for herself. The Kiris are magic. They heal people who get hurt in battle. They live close by. I could... Phoebe... I can do this. I'll be quick. Then we can fight the Cyclops. <sighs> All right. But don't take too long. Or I'm coming after you.
from Kefalonia. All of them are for the Cyclops. The Eagle Bearer. I overheard the Cyclops saying you were in the Underworld, but I didn't believe it. I'm looking for a girl. Her name was Phoebe. I is. Her name is Phoebe. They took a girl onto one of their boats, but... But what? She wasn't moving. Tell me where they were sailing. I couldn't see. The Charon's at the dock on the riverbank. 
No one sails without him knowing. How long ago did they leave? If you set sail now, you can probably catch up to them. But be quick. Get out of here while you can. I'm going to find the Cyclops and stop him once and for all. Take this as thanks. You can pay Haron to send you down the sticks after them. One of the prisoners said the Cyclops took a friend of mine down the sticks. Oh, the young girl from Elysium. They dumped her lifeless body into one of my old pods. Take me to her. What is it you fleshlings do to calm down? Breathe? Yes. Breathe and tell me what happened. The Cyclops hated me in life, and he hates me in death. He's using my friend to get to me. Help me stop this. Very well. I know precisely where the Cyclops of Kefalonia was taking your young friend. It's a gate. The place should seem familiar to all of you. <sighs> Thank you. Now we have to go.
It's my home on Kevalonia. How is this possible? Phoebe! Phoebe! Been a long time. Heard you and the girl finally came down to join us. Couldn't pass up the opportunity to show you both a warm Kevalonian welcome. If you hurt her... If... I will cut out your other fucking eye! And this time, it's going up your ass, Cyclops! No one calls me that! <laughs> Give it to me. Oh, no, 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 Ella, Ella. Earth, mother of all, I greet you. Yasso. Mm. Alexios? <laughs> you're okay! And you're... here. I'll always be with you, Phoebe. Forever. No matter what. Thank you. Can you stand? Oof. What is this place? And where is the Cyclops? Don't worry, the Cyclops is gone. And this is a doorway to Elysium. So that's it? Through there? I'll find my real parents. You can do this, Phoebe. Let's go. Seeing this place makes me miss Kefalonia. We had some good days, didn't we?
I don't want to go. You have no choice, Phoebe. You belong with your parents. No. I belong with you. Please, don't make me go. Don't be afraid. I'm leaving this place too, once I finish what I started. But I will be with you. I, uh, found this. Take it with you, to keep me close. What if... my parents don't like me? Of course they're going to like you. They'll do more than like you. They'll love you. But I won't be able to forget you. You're my family too. Can I come back here and find you? No. Once you leave, you can never come back. But one day, a long time from now, I will come to you. And we'll tell each other all about our adventures. You'll always be my family, no matter what. I think I'm ready. Phoebe, the warrior who sailed to the Golden Fields. Phoebe, who plunged into the underworld to save her family. Phoebe, the eagle bearer. You have made me so proud. Walk tall. I told you he wouldn't let the kid lose her memories. Instead, she drew out the child's own strength and inspired her to endure her burden. Remarkable. 